Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Brittany. And if this is your first time stumbling across one of my videos, I usually focus on fashion, beauty, luxury, lifestyle, fragrances, and pretty much whatever else I feel like talking about. So if that seems like something that you may be interested in, go ahead and click on that subscribe button if you enjoy the content, of course. Also, if you're already a subscriber, please click on that notification bell so that you do not miss an upload for me. All right, y'all, so today's video is going to be a fashion video. I do have some new pieces in my wardrobe that I just haven't gotten around to showing you all. Some of these things are fairly new. Some of them I've had for a couple of months, but we're going to tackle that today because I'm going to be styling up some of the pieces and some I may just haul and try on for you all. So if you guys are interested in seeing what I've added to my wardrobe, then stick around. Okay. So this first look is like a winter daytime look. And I love this look because it injects a little bit of color into my winter wardrobe and it keeps me super warm and I feel like comfortable and super stylish okay so first off I have on this um, rib turtleneck this is super old from Target if I can find it I'll link it down below it's just in like a cream color and then I also have on some light colored denim jeans these are skinny jeans I love wearing skinny jeans in the winter time because they're easy to tuck into boots and they're super comfortable because they're usually super stretchy but the star of the show is this gorgeous long knit cardigan that I picked up from Zara and this should be in the Zara sale maybe I'm not sure but we'll see um, I love this cardigan I did get this in a size large you can definitely size down because it's very oversized and on me because I'm only 5'1 it comes down to my ankles but on the website it comes like mid-length on the model so depending on your height is you know of course where it would stop on you but I love this cardigan so much because it has all of the color detailing and it's the orange and the lavender and it's just so beautiful some browns in there i do have my sleeves rolled up but you can also kind of like scrunch up your sleeves if you want to it's super thick very cozy it can be a little bit itchy but you know just put on some base layers so this would be really cute with a long sleeve cream t-shirt or like a bodysuit or a turtleneck or something like that because the weather has been so flip-flop i just did a tank top underneath but otherwise i would do like a turtleneck or something like that so yeah you can also do different colors under this as well and zara has been doing like these landscape type of cardigans and the first one that they came out with i thought it was cute but when i tried it on it just made me look like grimace or something like that it was so not made for me but this one elongates me and i love it so much so highly recommend this one like i said i got this in a large but you can definitely size you down see it wraps you know what i mean and this would even be cute maybe belt it yeah this is just a super cozy knit and it can elevate any outfit like i have it on with jeans but i could also do all cream with this you could do all black under this if you wanted to like a black cat suit um like turtleneck or whatever have you some combat boots i think that would be cute and then you can also do uh like all cream underneath as well so yeah love this now the best part to me is like styling up my pieces so i am doing some mixed metals here i have on this mixed metal necklace i got this from zara probably three years ago but you know they always have fun and cool jewelry and then i have on these really pretty earrings i don't know where i got these from i think maybe a boutique sent these to me a few years ago but i never wear them and i'm like these are so fun right so then my favorite these are pretty new in my um wardrobe i did pick these glasses up from Alisa Johnson and they are everything okay so they are a light tortoise color with a purple lens and oh y'all fabulous okay these are literally fabulous I love the way these look I love the way these look they're super lightweight very comfortable and I love a tinted lens because you can wear these during the day and you don't always have to take them off when you're inside of a you know establishment and the lighting is making it look darker than what it is you can totally see my eyes you know through these so I love that let me see if I can come closer yeah there we go this is how they look in real life okay super super cute I love these so much and they have a couple of other different color options as well but these were my favorite now for shoes I decided to go with a cream leather boot I've had these for a long time but I will link some down below that are similar and I love these because they have a low heel height so I can walk the mall if I want to it's perfect for brunch or you know whatever have you but you can also do like a cognac color boot or a camel colored boot I think a suede slouchy 
like camel colored boot will really set this off. I actually have a pair of peep toe ones that I should try on, but we'll see. And then for my handbag, I have a couple of options. So the first one is my Loewe puzzle bag. This is the mini and this is in the lavender color and it matches perfectly with this lavender in this knit. I am obsessed with this bag. It's so cute. Any opportunity that I can pull this out, I'm going to do it. So yeah, I love this bag and I can wear it crossbody so it's easy for like shopping and running errands. And then if I I wanted to go for a larger bag I can pull out my Fendi first now this is my Fendi first in the shearling the color is perfect it matches the brown in this sweater perfectly and the brown is at the bottom of the sweater more so and the sleeve part that I have rolled up but it matches it so perfectly so this is if I wanted to you know carry something a little bit larger I can carry it as a clutch or I can put it over my shoulder with the strap. So love both of these options for this look. So yeah, let me know what y'all think about this look. Highly recommend you guys get this cardigan. If it's available, I will link it down below. Okay y'all, so these next couple of pieces are sold separately, but I'm wearing them as a set. You guys know I live for a set. It's like super easy styling and I'm all about ease when it comes to my wardrobe. So I have this cream like bomber jacket. It's pretty oversized and I love the way it fits. Um, it's super cute. It's like a sweatshirt material material and also I got the pants and they are wide leg with a seam going down the front. I got both of these pieces in a size large and I just love like how it looks. I can elevate this with heels or I can wear it with some sneakers or I need to add a pair of those uh, platform Uggs to my wardrobe. I never thought that I would do that. But I feel like I'm needing them for the winter. Okay, let me know if y'all will pull the trigger on some Uggs. But I love this fit because like I said, it's super versatile. You can dress it up or you can dress it down. So I'm just styling this up super simply. I'm doing uh, the same gold jewelry, these hoops fun hoops. And then I have on the same chunky necklace. And for shades, I'm going to wear these like silver clear shades. I will definitely link these down below for you guys. These are definitely one of my favorite pairs. They're very similar to the Bottega Veneta uh, sunglasses. I'll throw them on real quick so y'all can see. They're pretty dirty, but you get the picture, right? So cute. Love, love, love these. And for a handbag, you can do like a casual bag. Like I have my Givenchy silver bag that I think would be really cute with this. Actually, I should have brought that down. And then also you can do um, a silver crossbody bag. Like I have my Chanel bag that I paired with it. I can hold it, you know, wear it like as a little small top handle if I want to dress it up a bit, or I can wear that crossbody and make it super casual if I may have on some sneakers or something. You can also do browns with this as well. If I had those Uggs, I would definitely Definitely wear like a brown handbag or something like that but yeah absolutely love this two-piece set it does come in three colors it comes in um, this cream color it comes in a washed gray that I was really thinking about getting and then it also comes in black okay so highly recommend like I said the jacket is oversized and then the pants I would say they run pretty true I got them simply because the length is good on me okay and I'm super short so it's really hard to find wide leg um, sweatpants in my length. So love these so much and I will link them down below. Hopefully they're in the sale so you can get these pieces, you know, discounted because this jacket itself, I think was $69. Okay. It's a nice weight, but it is still sweatshirt material. Let me know what y'all think about it though. <laughs> okay. Y'all. So next up I have the viral target jumpsuit. I got this jumpsuit actually back in September um, or maybe August when I was going to fashion week and I didn't get a chance to wear it because at the time New York was having a heat wave. Okay. But I love the fit of this jumpsuit. It is so good. I understand why it is viral and the fit is just great. So I got it in the denim and I feel like this jumpsuit in particular is perfect for curvy girls because it has the elastic in the waist. So it kind of cinches you in a little bit and gives you some shape. You can still size up if you want to just to get like a little bit more of a baggy feel but I love this so much. And of course, if you wanted to uh, have it fit a little bit tighter, you can size down because I feel like this is pretty generous. Um, I did get this in a size 14 and I love the way that this fits on me. I have it just zipped. It's just so easy. It's perfect. You can roll up the uh, pants leg like I'm going to style it today, or you can wear them just um, all the way down, maybe with some sneakers or boots, you know, whatever have you. So absolutely love this jumpsuit. I'm not sure if it's still available. I have seen the black and I probably need to pick that up too. It's like a wash black. You guys know I love my black. So to style this up today, I'm just going to pull out 
my cognac pieces, okay? So I have these super old boots in my collection. These are suede peep toe boots with a really good heel. And these are by um, Aqua Zara, I believe. Yes, Aqua Zora. So these are super cute. The suede on these are so soft. They are pretty high though. So I have to wear these like not shopping, you know what I mean? And this is like a shopping outfit, but I would do this to like, you know, brunch with the girls, stuff like that, you know, where I'm not just constantly walking, but I love these. I also have a way more comfortable pair of slouchy boots by, um, Paris, Texas, I think. I'll link those down below. So that's another great option. These are so old. I don't think these are available anymore. And then for my handbag, I'm just going to pull out my Jody dupe. I got this from Vici. Um, so if I can find something similar, I would definitely link it. But you guys have seen these bags a ton of times. The only reason I got it is because of the color. I thought that this would be the perfect like fall winter color. And I think I got this last year. But yeah, I love this so much. So it's really easy. And I wanted to carry like a larger bag. If I had more of a large tote bag, I would love that too. Like I could totally see this with like an old school speedy bag or um, just like an oversized Gucci bag or something like that. Just, I, I love like the oversized vibe, you know, for this. So yeah, let me know what you guys think about this jumpsuit. Again, highly recommend it. If I can find it, I would definitely link it down below. And I, and I picked this up in a size 14. So next up, I have this like faux leather brown corset type shirt. And I picked this up from Banana Republic on super, super sale. I'll link it down below if it's still available. Um, but it's super thin and I like it. It just is comfortable. I like kind of like the looser sleeves on this and this chocolate brown color is just everything. So I'm going to style this up with some baggy jeans, the same baggy jeans that I picked up from The Gap. And also I'm going to pull out my YSL fur heels. You're not going to really be able to see them. Um, I guess I could roll up the pants leg a little bit, but no, I don't think I want to. But these are really comfortable. I love these. And it adds like a little winter vibe. And clearly I can't get away from my Elisa Johnson uh, glasses. So I'm gonna pair it with these. And then I could do like a brown bag or I may do my Fendi clutch. Um, or I might do my Jacques Mousse brown bag. So yeah, let me know what you guys think about this look. Everything that is still available, um, I will put it down below, but a lot of this stuff I just pulled from my closet. And I picked up this brown shirt in a size extra large and there's plenty of room. So I really do love how this fits. And yeah, I highly recommend it. Okay y'all, so these next couple of pieces I picked up from a new to me store called Manier Devoir, I believe it's called. Um, so I got this super thick, heavy knit. <laughs> Y'all, it is so heavy and thick. Look at the material, okay? It is so hot, I'm literally sweating, okay? But I do love this. I think it's constructed really well. I picked this up in a size large or either a medium large. I'll have it down below for you guys. But this is a new to me brand. Um, when I did my try on haul for the Kai collection, someone commented asking me to test out this brand. So I did order a couple of things. I ordered this. I also ordered the skirt to go to this, but it does not flatter me that well. It's it's really bulky, um, so it doesn't really flatter me that well, but I'm kind of liking the top. It just kind of hangs off because it's so heavy. This is really cute though. I believe it comes in great as well. And then I also picked up this handbag, okay? So this bag you guys have been asking me about, it's like a cargo bag. So I thought this was super cute. I love the shape. It's a metallic black in a way, isn't that cool? So it's not really gray, it's like metallic black. And you can see all the detail on it. And it has this detachable little pocket here. So yeah, strap is adjustable. The pricing I would say is like mid range contemporary pricing. So I believe the top was maybe 200, the skirt was 200 or maybe a hundred each. And then this bag I believe was a hundred bucks. So, you know, pretty mid range price in my opinion, but the quality is there. The sizing, I believe they go up to a size 12 and like a size large. So just keep that in mind. That's why I went for the knits um, and this knit has some really cute detailing. I do like the buttons on here, 
But y'all let me know what y'all think about it. Now I decided to style this up with a pair of Gap jeans. Now these are the men's Gap jeans that everybody's going crazy about. They are um, marketed as unisex and they had this Gap ad that was like, you know, everything. So it's like Gap is definitely making a comeback. But I got these in a size 38 and they are really nice and baggy, which I've been looking for. But when you're plus size, it's kind of hard to pull off baggy jeans. But I do like the way that uh, they are baggy. Baggy. The seat is quite long on me, but the length is perfect. I got these in a 30 inch length and with heels, it looks really good. Um, so I don't know. Let me know if you think I should get these taken in in the waist or just like take them back all together. They're super comfortable because they're so big and it feels like I have nothing on, which is like my favorite thing in the world. But yeah, I'm not sure about these because again, the fit and all of that, but I do recommend them. The quality is really good and they were on sale for $27. I think they have now gone back up to the original price, which is 79, which I still think is a great price for a nice sturdy pair of denim. Okay. So I do recommend. Um, but yeah, I wear a size 14 by the way, just for reference. I also decided to pair this with my favorite shoes of the moment. These are my Versace Pinpoint Mules. I love these. Got these on sale and they're everything. Very comfortable to me. The only issue is like if you're walking on a soft surface, um, this heel, it does feel like it's coming under you, but on a hard surface, you can't tell. I've walked downtown in these, not on purpose, but I ended up walking downtown in these on Broadway and it was fine. So I love these, highly recommend them and they come in white as well, which are heavily discounted right now. So definitely check out these Versace mules. So yeah, let me know what you think about both of these pieces. So, okay, y'all, so I also picked up a knit dress from the same um, brand and I love this knit dress. I think it's cute, it really snatches. It's pretty short and it has a slit on the side. But yeah, this dress is super cute. This is in a size large very 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 thick and extremely well made listen this is for extreme winter okay these pieces um their knit is like extremely thick so when you wear stuff like this you don't need a coat if you do like you can wear like a thin trench even like in winter you know what i mean it's super 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 thick so yeah i love this dress love just like how it feels how it still snatches while still being like a thicker knit because sometimes thicker knits are like a little too flimsy like the um cardigan that i just showed you guys that's way more of a large you know yarn type of knit that is flimsy this one still snatches you and it looks really flattering on the body it doesn't add too much bulk either so i decided to style up the dress with my favorite tights and i've been wearing these sheer tights out okay and i do have a list of all of my favorite undergarments that will always be in the description box so just check that out if you are ever wondering about shapewear bras or tights leggings all those things i'll have that link down below i also decided to pair this with my um thigh high boots pick these up from macy's i love these boots they are extremely comfortable I have been living in these boots, okay? I may need to get a backup pair because they are not real leather and I wear them so much that, you know, sometimes the wear and tear. So I may get a backup pair of these, but I love these boots so much, highly recommend them. And they are wide calf friendly, even though they're not advertised as that. And for accessories, I'm just gonna do my large Bottega dupe earrings. I will have these linked down below as well. And I'm gonna pull out the Old Faithful Brandon Blackwood. This is like in a bandana print. I thought that this went with like, the style of the brand because it's super edgy so yeah I love this little bag <laughs> and I also love that the pieces are pretty edgy you guys know I love like all black in the winter time and edgier pieces so yeah I really like these pieces I will definitely keep my eye out for different things from the brand again I only tried the knit so I'm not really sure how the other items um you know wear but if you guys have tried out this brand let me know and send me over some suggestions also send me some suggestions of other brands you would like for me to test out because I definitely am just bored with a lot of things right now okay <laughs> so All right. 
right, y'all. So that's the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you found it helpful. I will also have everything linked in the description box down below, along with the size that I chose in each item. Any links that I can find, of course, they will be all down there as well. So just make sure you're checking out that description box. Also, moving into the new year, let me know some things that you would like to see on my channel moving forward. You can leave all of that down in the comment section down below, and I will be sure to check it out and add it to my list. So thank you guys again for watching, and I will talk to you on my next one. Bye, y'all.